How was your dating mindset when you were younger? Sure, I think just like many young black men, I grew up in the township. And as a young black man in the township, you will realize the inequalities that exist within your own peers mm -hmm. in terms of what they have that makes them eligible to date the people that they want to date. I understood it completely when the Makinsas came past our school with a fancy car, a with personality, with a fresh SKL, with a fresh clothes. I understood that the game works like this. Why must I be mad at this girl who's rolling with this guy with SKL and a Beamer when I'm the one wearing a gray flannel here and I've got five red in my pocket? Why am I mad? And I think I avoided becoming bitter and angry at women. You know when like you find situations where Men are kept calling a woman that's passing mm. and then and and then they swear at him. Yeah. I always feel like that's repressed anger because they haven't dealt with rejection J, 100%, 100%. in life. So Mina, when I started becoming a scholar of the game, I realized well, there's no need for me to be angry at someone who's exercising their choice. If they don't see me as someone who can take them to the next level. Because remember that dating is about levels. So Mina, I realized as a 17 year old growing up in Mamelodi that if the person that I want does not want me, it does not make them my post. enemy. Yeah, but I was like, what can I learn from them that makes them a choice for me? Ah. You understand? Are you scared of rejection? 100%. Okay, so basically this covers the, the, your actions towards yeah. women. I don't approach women in public places. I find that it's an invasion of their privacy to be approaching them randomly in a public space. So how do you approach women? That's quite interesting. I don't yes. approach them. They I told approach you. Bonke. Yeah, <laughs> what is 